What is going on everybody? I'm back making another video. I'm currently on the 41st shark. I'm on my final mutation. Uh, I'm actually kidding. I'm on the very last shark and it's called the... Actually, I'm not gonna spoil it even though you can already see it. I'm not gonna go through all the sharks again like I do in like every other video, but I'll show you the final 10 sharks in the final mutation. This is the 41st one. Or actually, I'll just show the shark since last episode. I think last episode I was on this shark and then in the thumbnail I used this rainbow shark because it was the one that I got right after I ended the video. And then the final shark is this money king shark. And then you mutate again, and then here are the final 10. You get really small again after you mutate, and then you are this shark. And then number 43 is this shark. The final 10 sharks in the final mutation all look really, really cool. And then here's the hammerhead one, number 44. Here's number 45. I really like the look of all these sharks. Number 46, number 47. This is This one is super cool. It's like a ninja or something but this is the whale shark and then the 48th one is this and then the 49th one is this huge like angel shark and then the final shark the leviathan king he is huge a bunch of stuff all over um oh yeah i also have the secret skill um i only got two of the divines and i got the secret i'll go show you guys so as you can see i can take everyone out in this area i can even go to the final area now obviously because I'm on the final shark but if you look at this egg over here as you can see I didn't even get the legendary yet and I got the secret really early on so I've been grinding with the secret from the final area and I've had 50 times me earning for like the last 48 hours or something so here is the second guy in the final area you guys saw the first one over there with the weird looking mouth this is the second guy I one shot him and then if you come over here um actually let me turn off fast mode so that it looks better. I had fast mode on, but I'm while I was grinding, but while I'm recording, I want it to look really nice. So we're going to come over here. This is the final enemy, the Dragon King. I've already defeated him a few times. He's not that easy for me to defeat. As you can see, I actually die like every other time I defeat him. But once you get to the very final shark and you get over level 100, as you can see, my food and my DNA is completely filled up. So there's nothing else to do left in the game other than go all all the way back to spawn and if you come over here or actually wait i want to check the leaderboard before i ascend because i actually wonder if it like resets me on the leaderboard or not i want to see what i'm on right before my first ascension so i'm number 19th on highest xp leaderboard i think there's i think there's literally like 16 people that have ascended yesterday so if i'm 19th on the xp leaderboard and i'm about to ascend there's probably been 18 total people that have ascended so there's only 18 other people in the entire game that have gotten this far. Leviathan required, which is the final shark. I have the Leviathan shark. So we can now go to Atlantis. It teleports us to a completely different world. This is my first time ever being here. I've seen what it looks like and I know of this place. I've just never actually been here. So what do you do? You kind of just swim down this really long hallway and then you get to this. This is the Bermuda Triangle. You need nine ascensions to get into the Bermuda Triangle, and I'm pretty sure there's an even stronger boss behind the Bermuda Triangle. I think only two people in the entire world have gotten to the ninth ascension, and one of them was a hacker that got banned, so he's gonna stay on the leaderboards, but he can't progress any farther, so he'll just drop down eventually whenever a bunch more people get really good at the game. But if you guys want me to keep grinding this game and get through nine ascensions, I'm gonna have to completely restart with only my skills that I obtain and work through all 50 sharks nine times nine more times to get to the bermuda triangle but i'm pretty sure there's a super overpowered boss so i really want to try to get into the bermuda triangle get nine ascensions so you go over to poseidon and you will ascend well i'm surprised you made it here i've been watching you and i've got to say that great battle with the dragon king was something fine i'll let you inherit my legacy the only problem is my power is too powerful you'll lose everything in the process including your skills sharks and levels but i'm sure the new legacy skill will be worth it so you lose your old skills your sharks and your levels on all your sharks but you get the ascension legacy skill that's even better um let me check the stats of or i can't check the stats of my secret i'm pretty sure it was like 33 sx or something we can go back in the video and look but the secret that i had from the ninth area i'm pretty sure isn't even as good as any of the legacy skills and you get a better legacy skill each 
time from ascending. So undergoing the ascension, we're about to completely restart and lose the shark. If we go over to my settings, I can't even switch back to it. So, oh, and I'm in a public server too, for some reason, when I was in my private server. But if we go to my inventory, as you can see, we get the first phase, Firestorm Godly. So we have 10 power right now. So if we charge, we should have, um, how much... How much power do we have? Wait, what? Evolve. Okay, so we're at 40 power now? Why is this first phase thing not... It doesn't tell me how strong it is. Damage and HP, first phase. It literally just says damage and HP, first phase. I don't know what that means. It says my total power... Oh, wait, my total power was 40, and now it's seven wait i'm so confused i thought that the new ascension skill was supposed to be super overpowered i'm gonna have to actually grind through the whole game again and it's gonna be hard that's not what i expected at all okay so we have 640 total power um we need to get stronger apparently so that we can take out the penguin boss we're gonna have to run some boost or something auto train yeah we're gonna have to run some boost or something what in the heck okay we're gonna need not more learning points because we already have the ascension skill we don't really need learning points anymore but i kind of want to do more damage and have more health let's buy five hours of 10 times damage and five hours of 10 times health and let's see if we can grind through the game a little bit better with that oh wait no that's pvp stuff oh my gosh dude i just wasted my atlantis coins that's pvp stuff i don't want that oh my god no i just wasted my atlantis okay well i guess we'll get five times damage pve for one hour that's all that we we can get what the heck dude what is that at least we have our 50x meat earning but i didn't really want to like waste my atlantis coins we need more dna earning also so i'll buy some dna earning for an hour oh i should have got dna earning and damage i didn't want the pvp stuff that was such a waste okay so that's pretty much the end of this episode um stop auto training can i kill the penguins yet i need to mutate okay there we go so i'm gonna have to work through the entire game again um, I have, okay, so I'm not charged right now, and I'm 20 power, so we charge, and it's 40 now? That's only double. That's, that's not good at all. I thought the ascension skills were, like, insanely OP. I, I mean, maybe they get more OP as they go on, but I, this one isn't that good. What is happening? All right, I'm gonna get back to grinding. I have eight more ascensions to do for the next video. I really hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, make sure you hit the like button, comment some ideas for more future videos down below, hit the subscribe button if you have not already, and yeah, whenever I get a few more more ascensions i should be able to run through the game a lot quicker and be a lot more overpowered and then we'll go to the bermuda triangle and defeat the final final boss all right later everybody